everyone and today I am going to do mix daily training let's have fun and let's go okay let's try this let's see n 0 98 against every second matches Plains Mitch J Mikia Misha I don't know good luck D5 6 This I was thinking of C5 and like knight C6 now Let's try it This Okay, uh, he takes, I take. Okay. This. Uh, bishop e6. Alright. Maybe my isolate pawn isn't the best, but okay. My idea is d4. Let's play bishop e7. Yeah, that's a nice move from my open end. Oh, I actually didn't check his from, I don't know. Okay. I'm not sure I'll split an IT4, I think. Take them and I think we're gonna take with the queen. Okay, and I d4. In a d4, if it takes a play, probably seems like rook a c8. Yeah, let's play it. Takes, takes. I mean, if bishop trade the sake, it should be alright, but he may play queen e4 and then try to win this endgame because oh, I'm not sure how he'll win it. I mean, I think a6 is the move I need to play, and like, I don't know. Uh, I mean, maybe knight is a little bit better than the bishop, but my pawns are on light squares, so... I can't really say my bishop is worse than his knight, to be fair. 
Mm. Well, I was thinking about bishop c4, bishop g3, just so I will defend my e4 pawn and my bishop is more or less active. Uh, well, I mean, bishop c4 shouldn't hurt. Let's see. Okay, rook f1, and then I was thinking bishop d3. I mean, knight f5, I play queen f6 or something. And yeah. I mean, I don't know. We'll see <laughs> what will happen. Okay. Rook c3, he wants to double up as it seems. Yeah, maybe his knight is actually a little better, I'm not sure, because he gets the control over a C file. I don't know how I can prevent that. Maybe it's not something which I just have to, well, accept. <laughs> oh, definitely will take. Twenty seven. This twenty six and yes, this power. Oh, I just wanted to oh, miss that. I have to be more careful. Well, yeah, here knight f5 and queen g6, knight g7. If queen f6, it just takes, takes, and it's a pawn up. Okay, let's let's be a bit more careful now. <laughs> Um, let's see, I mean, I can trade queens and please, it's really like passive endgame. Well, I'll take and maybe b5, like rook a8. Yeah, let's play b5. I'm not sure if b5 was actually a good move, but I don't really want his pawns to take all the space and to have my pawns have like no space at all. Well, to that his pawns claim all the space in this position. Yeah, that's a nice move from him, h4. This I technically just walk, walked into knight c6, so I'm not so sure about this move. B4, okay. Uh, here a5 idea. I didn't want to do bishop c4, because there he would have a4, and I guess at the very least he has a5 and I have no space, and yeah, I don't know. Let's see, here, 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 here. Yeah, that looks fine-ish. I mean... Standard and just watching. I mean, this is definitely was definitely a plan, but I don't really like it. <laughs> a 
take it takes takes and here's this knight d6 it's rook c8 idea take rook c8 just like I cannot do anything like this. You still have h5 go. Um, yeah. I don't know, King G6. Oh, I guess so. Time and I can't say position is a dream, <laughs> but but I'm working on it. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> mm, I gotta play faster now, can I five? Can you six? G6, nice move. I gotta play. I mean, I didn't have to, but yeah, that's nice idea. Knight f4, so he's g2 pawn one hang. It's a really nice idea from him, actually. Mm -hmm. I don't have a so his skin cannot move. That is definitely not pleasant. Here. Mm -hmm. His skin is free. <laughs> position is definitely unpleasant. <laughs> just gotta make some moves, I guess. <laughs> and just try to not give my pawns away. Sure if it was really good of, I mean, for him to give the fifth strength for my rook. Uh, 
the only thing I think I have to do is like play fast and hope for the best. <laughs> Knight h3 was an option. The rook g5 would have been smarter to start with. The rook g5. A rook g6. No, I missed that. Oof. Mm. Not sure. Yeah, that was a miss. Rookie six. E <laughs> Rookie takes, okay. I know I can't do that. Ooh. That was bad. Oh, that was like really bad. Wow. Uh. No, I have my bishop. Oh, he didn't see it. Uh -huh. Oh, wow, that's a draw. Crazy game. Was really me here. 
Oh dear, good, <laughs> thank you. Yeah, I somehow held it. <laughs> uh, G5 was the lucky one, I guess. Oof, yeah, I mean, I just hung my bishop here. Oof, he had knight d4. Oof. Yeah, here I wasn't sure. He, like, tricked me, actually. I was like, bam, but then can you see knight f3? I don't know. Uh, maybe it's it's equal. Whatever. Oh, dear. Yeah, it was equal. Yeah, I was holding this somehow. Yeah, it was equal. Oh dear, that was a game. <laughs> How did we play with so on it accuracy when he was winning? Wait, there he also had the chance. Oh yeah, rookie six, of course. Hmm. He still has one on the accuracy. Interesting. They just have one bishop over since such in time trouble. Oh yeah, this and this uh, space. It's 90 sculpting, which should be two. This, this, and that's a draw. Alright, uh, so you see more. <laughs> and if I this, still an easy draw. Well, so that was a great game, but I held well. 99 accuracy. Lichus is definitely weird. <laughs> 100 for him, 99 for me, what? Oh no, I'm not, oh no. So we'll take a while to eat. Ah, so we play with 99 accuracy, see? So. Yeah, okay, 86, 85. So 225 for him, 414 for me. Oh, that was a game. <laughs> yeah, queen d6 was a blunder, right? I had to go for it, he had this 95, what I was talking about. And then, yeah, he's just winning. This, this, this. Rook b2 mistake, I'd go for rook b7. And just trying to hold passively, but hold. Here he had rook a7. Yeah, right, rook a7, I would have nothing. <laughs> right, here he had knight h5. This, this. Uh, and then, yeah, he would be better. He would take my last one. That's winning. I go for rook b5. He had to go for rook a6, and then rook g6 or knight d5. Then knight b6. No, wait, not knight b6, just rook a7, and he's winning. Okay. This is. G4 blunderer, he had to go for rook d2. And I found the draw maneuver. He would just have to go for king f7, and king h4, take, and that would have been holdable. Because after rook g5, instead of rook g5, he could have played rook e6, take on e4, and that would be totally windy for him. Then it was a draw. At like, not much time. Well, he also didn't have much time, so I was holding. And here I spent a lot of time, and just there wasn't good, but it was equal. And here I go for bishop e6, and if knight h2, this, this, bishop c4, is knight is cut, and that's a draw. And if he plays e5, then this, his knight is cut, and that's a draw anyways. And this, this, here he had knight e4, just winning my bishop, and with that the game. Uh, but he played knight g5, takes, and I played this bishop d1. Uh, he played this, and after that there was a draw, because bishop c2 not allowed his knight to move. This, 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 the yeah, knight c5 would still, like, give him some hopes, but it would still be very equal. Just hopes that I wouldn't make it in time. But after knight of 2 I was lucky, and that, and that, and I took on g4, and then insufficient material, the rotary mechia. That was a game. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but I held it. It was insane. King f7, and then just play bishop e6, easy draw. Yeah, I just blundered to e5, and then king e6, this. <laughs> okay. Mm, let's see, rook a7, rook a... S no, wait, 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 wait. Knight h, no. Yeah, knight h5. Knight h, no. <laughs> rook a6, right. Rook a7, not right. Rook d2, right. Then rook is oh mouse slip oopsie and then knight d4. Okay. So that was a cool game. Uh let's see share and export download roll. The download roll. There you go, thank you. Let's analyze. That was a crazy game. <laughs> it was pretty good until I played this queen d6 and we traded queens and that was not so good. Wait, where's my game? I have no idea. Heh. I opened the game, okay, it's just slagging, whatever, whatever. I mean, opening was played fine by both of us. 
this, 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 maybe slightly better, let's disconnect, and maybe if I'm interested, move to get the D4, uh, this, 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 yeah, he's better because my opponent, so, okay, that was a mistake, that was a beautiful B6 move, and after Queen B6, I play Rook B8, and yeah, I just simplify, and that's total draw. Right, it's like impossible for him to win. But okay, Queen C3, here, 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 here. That was a blunder. I just had to go for Rook D8. And then after Queen C7, play in like, I don't know, Rook D7. Queen F4, Queen G5. And it's, comp I mean, Rook C8 here. Queen B8 is better. Okay. Queen C5. Uh, yeah, Queen C5 was a blunder. He just said Knight F5. And if queen g6 blunder the knight e7 he's winning and if queen f6 there is this 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 and then his knight even comes or he plays g4 and he's just won as well this mm, okay i played b5 i just want to get more space i mean maybe a5 was not good yeah it was a mistake i'd go for like king f8 and play it more safe like wait what he will do this this then play bishop e6 here, 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 king, no, wait, what? Aha, uh -huh, rook e5, king f6, rook e4 here, and I would have after king e7 compensation. Yeah, he cannot really win this two pawns, so it's more or less fine. Uh, but knight b5 this, I was already like almost lost-ish. Uh, this, this, he can take because CDI would be fine there, or maybe even winning, probably not win, but fine. Uh, this, mm-hmm. That was a mistake, I'd go for rook b5, and after rook a7, go king e6, knight f4, this, but it's still like totally winning after g4. Okay, um, but yeah, knight f4, a mistake, he had to go for rook a7, just no chances, I'm not in time to do anything, two points down, totally lost position for me. But this why I didn't disconnect yet, I don't know. H5 was a mistake. He yeah, he had to leave the square for his knight. So basically knight h5, this knight here, here, rook a4, there, and that's winning because he had second pawn. So that uh, yeah, maybe I'm playing not playing the best way. That was a mistake from him, he had to go for rook a6 check. And then bishop is here, here, and that's totally one. Because rook c4 was another mistake. I had to go for rook b7 with... No, wait, not rook b7, rook b5. Ah, rook a4, okay. So still getting, keeping control over force rank and holding. How is this a blunder? What? Oh, yeah, okay, what's rook b4? No, well. Yeah, rook a4. Still with, I mean, I mean, it's only lost. Well, let's say it's compensation there, okay? Kind of a brilliant move. Uh, rook e7, rook c5, yes, I got the control. That was a mistake, yeah, I just had to go for king e7. Just play it safe, just get, yeah, there, king d8, rook e8, king 7 here, here, king f4, rook f5, with compensation, of course. Uh, king h4, nice move. This, this, I repeated that. That was a big blunder from him. I just had to go for king g4. And then after king e7, knight g6. I have to go for king d8. He has king f4. This, 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 this. g4. And he's totally winning. I totally lost. I have nothing. That, that. Okay, rook c5 was another mistake. I had to go for king e7. And then, oops, yeah, here, this, and then that would be with compensation. Alright, g4 was another mistake, right? Yeah, that's crazy. How many mistakes we did? Oops, that would be a blunder, actually. Don't hang your rooks like that, guys. Uh, yeah, rook d2, great move, and then after king e5, you play rook d8, and that's only one. Uh, bishop d7, and now it's actually simplified, so that was actually a blunder, g4. Uh, this, 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 and that sequel, that, that was a blunder for me! Uh, I had to go for king h7, and then king, uh, king f7, king h4, rook g6, knight g6, king f6, and that's a draw-ish! Uh, rook g5 was a total blunder for me, I had to go for rook e6, and basically after I placed rook e6, this, his two pawns up, no chances for me left. That, now it was pretty equal, okay, bishop h5 actually worked! Which five is a nice move. I mean, knight g7. 
Knight g7, bishop g6, that's an easy draw, I think. King h3, bishop h7, you don't force. Yeah, okay. Not easy, but yeah, I mean, it's easy. He cannot get g5 pawn. I was worried after this that he had that, that, and here, but king e6 is a move I missed, and that's a draw. Alright, knight d6 here. This, this, this. I mean, it's still holdable. Only sin was little problem with my time. I was pretty low on it. This, yeah, I decided to go for activization with my kin. Here he got me. Kin e4, I was scared. Yeah, knight e4 was a nice move, but I was scared of this. I cannot take, so I went back. It was still fine. e4 would have been unpleasant, but still equal. This, this, uh, this, uh, kin e5 would be nice, I guess. Kin e5. Okay, bishop h7 would be just equal. The move I missed is g6, right? Yeah, I guess so. But bishop g8, it says, is just the total draw. Okay, okay. Kin f3, this, this, total draw, that, that. Here, that was a blunder. Well, I, yeah, I took off for bishop e6. And then after he goes e5, I go king e7, knight g5, that's a draw. And if he goes for knight h2, then I play bishop d5, king f here, here, and that's a draw. Okay, e5, this, and that was a total blunder from him. He had knight d4, king e5, this, and he's only winning. <laughs> but he missed that. And then after, even after a shock, I found how to draw, just play g5, so he will never win my pawn. And bishop f7, I took his pawns and draw. <coughs> I was more than happy with that result. And Rodri Mehja, that was a really crazy game, to be fair. Uh, but it was fun to play. <laughs> if I'm not mistaken, it is 2 to 9. Is it? Yeah, it's just 2 to 9. It's the same I remember. Cool. Okay, let's see. Oh wow, oh wow, is white going to hold with like no time? Wait, what? Wait, what actually? White won. So they had zero seconds to two. And then black thought for way too much, and Queen E3 just put black into a shock. Wait, how is. Oh, yeah, this 30 seconds tricks, huh? <laughs> Thanks, Lalit Saho. He's from India. Good luck. So I played him. Let's see. Uh huh. Was in the seven months ago elite bullet. Then I lost. They just plundered. And another elite bullet. Okay, let's go for C4. He's going for Grunfeld or Kins. Okay, he goes for Kins India. Uh huh. Mm, let's see going for bishop g4, right? No, e5. Well, takes. Queen d8 and then bishop g5. Yeah, it definitely works if he doesn't play knight c6 and e5 immediately. Uh, I'm not sure about that. Ella won, right? No? How oh, did he blunder? Like, oof. That must be painful. It's like totally, totally winning. You didn't take the knight. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's 30 second chess is brutal, guys. <laughs> An ultra bullet is even more brutal. <laughs> oh, I'm on rapid TV. Okay. Oops. <laughs> okay. So let's see, wait, didn't open his profile. So it is Harshit Ranjan Sahu from India and he has a federation of 1837. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay. Let's see what he will play. Because I'm pretty sure I some I mean probably like not even close, but at least he saw for some time, so maybe it actually somewhat surprised him. <laughs> probably not at all, as I already said. 
Um, I think 95 is a nice move right here. And then if knight he takes 95, I'm going to take knight uh, cd5. And then 94 I take, take bishop d3. Sounds like that. Uh, takes, yeah, I mean, I'm pretty sure. Or knight d4 or bishop d3 are my only moves. Maybe bishop d3 is actually more challenging for him, I'm not sure. By a war spawn structure. So, you know, I'm not really sure about that. But maybe it is interesting. I don't know. Uh, this, I mean, f5 breakthroughs are somewhat scary, to be fair. Uh, I think I should be alright. Let's play bishop d3. I'm not sure about that. But we'll, uh, we are playing for fun, so let's go. Okay. It takes and ruins my pawn structure, so now I have double pawns. I can't say it really like ruins, uh, but okay. I think rook a c1 and then c6, bishop c4 is a nice setup, and then put another rook to d1. Uh, let's see, I think I'll play rook, or maybe I can play bishop e3, getting my bishop back with tempi, tempo tempi. I don't know. Yeah, I think it looks interesting. Right. Yeah, a6, and I was thinking rook fd1, and if c6, bishop c4, cd takes, bishop 6, takes, takes, and f d6. Yeah, not sure, maybe it's way too irrealistic. f5 is an option for him, but it was an option as well there, if I would have my bishop on g5, so I'm not sure whether it's really bad decision or no. Um, let's see, bishop f Eight. Interesting, interesting. He wants to put his bishop on d6 as far as I can understand this move. And then just put a giant block uh, for my d pawn. Uh -huh. Nice plan. It's a plan for sure. Mm -hmm. Let's see if I have anything. Well, I definitely have like bishop c5. Mm, or maybe, I mean, bishop c5 is definitely an option. Or maybe I can find something else. Maybe I can play like a3 before bishop c5 or something like that. I don't know. Um, oh, I don't know. I think a3 is a nice prophylaxis move to be fair with you all. Just to prevent bishop b4 and stuff. And maybe at some point prevent to play, uh, prevent, uh, prepare to play b4. So I'm not sure. Bishops, if I infiltrate bishops, should be really cool and pleasant. And uh, yeah, I mean, if you want to play bishop d6, should be fine and cool also. But he plays bishop d6 and puts a massive block. Um, okay, okay. I was thinking about rook to c3 and then rook to dc1 doubling up. Not sure. Yeah, that looks interesting. Yeah, that's why I played rook c3. Or rook c3. That's why I played c3. I'm not sure why, to be honest, if I'm looking at this. But my idea is to do this, uh, this, and then this. Cool! Let's see what I'll get from it. Uh, he definitely can play like f4, g5, g4 and stuff. Which can be unpleasant, but we have to see. Do -do. Okay, place f4. Um, well, rook c one if he takes take oops takes 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 this 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 
if it goes like in here or this, 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 and then I don't know. Looks looks like a open file, but here's rook c8, pleasant move. And I mean I have an open file, but he treats my rook off with this open file, and I don't have anything, do I? I'm not sure about that. Well, I can play bishop c4 and then d takes c, I think. Yeah, I'll have to see. First of all, he has to play bishop c5, but okay, he plays king to f7 actually. Interesting move to be uh, to be fair with you. Um. Okay, this this this. This. Hmm. This, 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 this. Okay, um. takes. Eh, I'm not sure about king f7 because now. I mean, he wants to protect the bishop, but the bishop wasn't hanging overall because I couldn't take because my rook is hanging, but now it actually hangs. I don't know. Maybe it's a mistake from him. I don't know. <laughs> this. Um, okay. I think I'll do this just to because my bishop wasn't placed that great, I think. Um, yeah, let's play bishop of one. Just to regroup my bishop. Okay. Let's see what he will do next. Okay. So he's still thinking. First, he needs to take his time because it's his time, and in case you can't force your opponent to move faster. Mm, yep, of course. <laughs> of course. Still thinking. Right. Okay, still thinking, I got some good, decent time advantage now, it's pretty nice. I'm pretty sure if he takes rook c7, rook c7, rook c8, for example, I have rook b7 and rook c1, king g2, there is not much I should worry about, bishop a6 is a threat, if I'll be two pawns up, I mean, that's pretty nice. And if he plays ever h5, I think h4 is a move. So let's see, this, 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 this. This he can play g5, but I can play h3 first and bishop a6, bishop b5, trade his bishop in time. So I'm almost having two times his time now. 
okay looking very good on time perspective from time from time point of view at least and it's not so easy for him to find a move as it seems or he's like calculating some force draw which i'm missing i'm not sure about that but he's definitely thinking about something it takes him quite a lot of time So now he has just 1 minute 50 seconds left, let's see, okay he does take, takes, rook c8, okay I think rook b7, uh, I mean rook g7 doesn't give me anything, rook c8 as well, so I gotta take that pawn, and uh, I mean it's nice, it's right by think, uh, bishop is the reason it's right by think king g2 is bishop a6 idea, it's a pretty nice move, so let's go for it. Yeah, this and I was thinking bishop a6 and just trying to trade his bishop away. And if he plays h5, I play h4. Should be pretty good, I think. Well, this, uh, this, 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 this. I have h3 at the very least and it looks pretty nice. Mm. I think there's nothing wrong with this. Maybe I'm way, being way too greedy, but I don't see why it should be bad for me. So, well, now I'm thinking about bishop b5. I mean, if take takes, I think that's winning. And if bishop c8, there's like rook h7, and g4. I mean, it should be good. And I can just take an h3, or I can just ignore his threat and play like bishop c6 and stop. I think. So, well, bishop b5, I think, is a move to go to play. Yeah, and I mean, rook game is winning. Two passers. And I can even sack them with two of these pawns. And I'll have another passer, and that should be winning. I think if, like, he doesn't want to lose immediately, he has to play bishop c8, but then I take f h7. So, yeah, I'm not sure if he'll be happy with that. And after g4, I mean, I can, if, even if I'm scared, I can play like rook h8, rook c8, then f takes g, and I have two passers, four passers, b, a, and h and g. <laughs> Maybe that's what I'll actually go for, I'm not sure. Because, I mean, it looks like very hard to lose that. Uh, I mean, yeah, I think rook h7 looks good to me. Yeah. Well, I don't see anything wrong with it. Just making like just being extra sure, <laughs> so I don't want anything. Yeah, I mean rook e7 if I want to be like really safe or something. But I think rook e7 is a good move. I mean as I already said, I have this this. If I'm really really scared, um. So I was thinking about going like bishop c no b4 maybe first to not give him bishop a6. And I'm like, before, what is his idea? He can do this, right? Right, yeah, he can. Or I can play bishop e2, bishop f3. Oh, that's actually... Yeah, he creates counterplay. That's what you have to do when you're worse. Create counterplay as much as you can. Well, I'm still not sure about this rook h8, rook c8 idea, <laughs> to be <laughs> completely fair with you. Uh, No. I think there should be like something else. Uh, maybe a4? Yeah, just a4 so I don't even allow him rook c3. Let's see, rook a4, a4, his bishop cannot move. So he can move, but then I have like a5, this, a6. Of this and then I have like bishop f1 or something. Ah, I don't know. Let's play a4. Shouldn't be blundering anything big. I hope. <laughs> I definitely could have played like rook g7 or rook h4. Hmm. 
Maybe if rook c2 I can go rook g7 and then gf king f3 and then rook b2 h4 king b3 king g2 something like that and then push. Eh, I don't know. And bishop h3 f king g king h2 and then push. Looks good. I mean it's three pawns even though they're doubled. It doesn't have much harm to play Dacia and I'm mean, like really good on time as well. Which is which cannot <laughs> be nice. Uh, well, which cannot not be nice, I guess. Well, king f3 is the only move, so... Yeah, that's... he tries to checkmate me. Well, first of all, I can do this, as I already told, but I think h3 is a safe move. Well, let's see, h3, rook h1, I have king g2, safe and easy, his bishop cannot move, and I think h3 is just a safe move overall. This I'm thinking king g2, a5, a6. Do this, 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 yeah, I don't know. Uh, I mean, I can allow him to take play rook h8, so... I mean, I have two extra passers that should be winning-ish. I mean, f3... Oh, rook in f3. Yeah, king f3, so my king can go. And then adventure, h4... Uh. Another game, Lilit Saho, he's from India. Good game, thank you. Well, that was pretty interesting. Uh, I hope stream is back. I don't know. Um, no, thank you. Playing the match. It is uh, Harshit Ranjan Sahu. Good game. Yeah, I don't know. I think he maybe could have spent less time. Uh, because he spent like four minutes. The thing is that if you play something like that, for example, I have rook d7, bam, rook d7, rook c8, and uh, king d7. There is uh, a king of six only good move, okay. <laughs> and if king d8, there is rook g7 as well. And then bam, and I'm totally winning. So that was one nil nil game from me and three one nil game from him. Okay, d takes c was the only inaccuracy. Then game I played perfectly. That's pretty that's pretty nice. Um, yeah, f4 maybe wasn't good. King of seven was definitely not good. He could have just stayed like here, here, and like what what is my idea? You can just play bishop h3, and I'm the one who. Who hopes? Who need to hope for a draw? Because I mean, you have this, this, and you have this, this, and you have this, and then you are the one who is better. Because I me, mean, yeah, I'm just worse. But okay, after this, 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 here he had to go for king of six. That he would be passive, but it's much better than in the game. I would win a pawn or two, but still, it's much better for him than in the game. Because this, he just had to give me like three pawns. And yeah, maybe it was a little shake at the realization part, but doesn't look like this to computer and here he run out of time, but I was only wondering him Lali Saho. Good game. So I played three one nil also. Just one mistake. Pretty good, pretty good. Um and I played pretty well, one nil nil as well. And uh, well I, I cannot really say there was an inaccuracy when I played DE. I mean that's a line, that's perfectly a book move. Like how is this a mistake to you? I don't know, but yeah. Um, so knight c6, usually e5 is played here, and then d works, I think, maybe a little better, but castle, this... No, but that's actually main... main kid, isn't it? I don't remember, I don't know. Mm-hmm. Okay, bishop g5 is actually better. But yeah, that's, I think, like, one of them. Key positions you get from this opening, this... Okay, bishop d3, people... No, yeah, I played bishop d3, like, so... Can you go do something else? Uh, this is... Mm-hmm. Okay. So, rook c1, rook c8. This, yeah, I'm not so sure about that move. Uh, yeah, rook c3 immediately would be a bit better. I played a bit slowly, not gonna lie. That was an inaccuracy. Yeah, if you had to play king of 7, then no. And then basically, if I take... I mean, b4... This, 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 uh, this, and so this is just a drone, that's the best way for me. But if I take here, for example, let's say an inaccuracy, rook f8 uh, here, king e7, ah, king e7, king d6, oops, king d6, and he's the one who, we can is the blockade piece, and that's better for him. Um, whatever. This, that was another inaccuracy, he had to go for uh, king f7 again, and then basically this, and then put your king as a blockade piece. Well, that would be equal, so okay. Rook d1, that was, now that was an inaccuracy. Now you have to play like rook d8. 
So bishop f1 preventing bishop h3 the end of variation. This, this, this. Dc, rook c6, rook c6, bc6, ba6, rook d2. I'm a pawn up, uh, but this, 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 this. ba, rook d4, rook b6, rook a4, a6. No, not a6, rook b5, king g7. This is threatening me, I gotta go here, here, rook b5, rook a3, king h2, rook a4, a6 takes, king g3 h5, king f3, and like rook a3, king g2, or, or king f4, okay, that, that's sequel, alright, makes sense, yeah, uh, this, 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 king e7, that, that was a mistake, he had to go for king f6, yeah, I actually just totally missed, I said he had like no moves left, uh, and basically, uh, rook 1, c3, here, here, rook bishop c8, that, and I would be better, the nasty variation I thought was, is if he plays this, then I have that, that, and maybe b4, yeah, maybe b4, but I was thinking bishop b6, bam, and like, or, yeah, seems like that, I think, and I mean, okay, a5, king g2, I just didn't care, play h4, king h3, all this stuff, and well, maybe I have to care and play, like, whatever, I was thinking of that after, like, king e8, right, I, um, I just say, like, I don't care, and then I play b4 by myself, fixing the pawn structure there, and basically, if he takes, it's a mistake. D, his rooks cannot move at all. I mean, only rook can move to a8. And then, it's like, totally winning for me. And this, and that's king. That king is weak. I don't, I don't know what, what is red color, so we'll have like this. It's the only one. Um, so rook c7, this, this, and then the realization part was pretty clean, I think. I cannot say I'm like super proud of it. I spent way too much time on it, but... Well, I was decent. <laughs> yeah, I think he didn't maybe defend the best way. Rook b1, trying to reach a pawn, maybe it was the more fighter move. I don't know. And this in here, time forfeit, but I was completely winning. So I won 3 in Lalitsaho. Um, Alright. Liches games with analysis and my games on Liches. So it's 2.30. Good, good, good. Let's go and let's play the computer. Right. Uh, this, this, I'm black again, it's not random at all, whatever, <laughs> it's like absolutely not random, here, mm -hmm, 96 here, this, please take, I'm not begging. Or, yeah, thank you so much. And my ID is default. Don't play C for playing ID2 as you usually play. Thank you so much. 94. I actually don't know if I should go for it. Or bishop d6. Mm. <coughs> what am I saying? 94 years we. I'm sorry. What am I doing? What am I saying? <coughs> I'm sorry, guys. <coughs> bishop e7, just take. Not f4, no, not f4, no, not f4, no, not f4, don't play f4, oh, he played f4. I don't know what to do. <coughs> well, I was thinking about c5, a, but then he has c5 and f5, a, so I don't know if it's good for me, I know, so I don't want to risk it, a, a, a. I think I'll play bishop b7 and hope that he will take on d5, a. No, he plays e5. I don't like that much. Oh no, queen h5, that's scary. Help somebody me, please. Help somebody me, please. Help me somebody, please. There you go. <coughs> g6. My queen h6, alright, alright, I see where you're going. Uh, well, I can fianchetter my bishop uh, here. And he goes there. I was thinking about going c5, like c5, c4. Do, 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 do. Oh, but he has bishop g6. Does it work? Okay, didn't go for it. I'm not sure <laughs> if it actually means it doesn't work or he just didn't calculate deeply. Well, I'm going c4. I'm like somewhat telling take or move. Okay, move. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate that. I was thinking about bishop c5 and then taking and queen b6 something. Just like simplifying position and playing on dark squares. Ooh, that's a really nasty move from him, I can say. Oh, wow. 
that's really interesting. Well, I think I'm going to do this, and Queen E3, I'm probably going to trade Queens off. Um, there is no catch. Well, I'm going to do this. The only like issue is that he'll have a really strong blockade knight. I guess I gotta like say no, you're in blockading. Uh, well, let's play knight d7 here and here, maybe. If he lets me. I mean, I'd be eight. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I can play like this, 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 knight b6. Uh, but then, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. A5, A4, take, take, and that's okay. Well, maybe I can longside castle and like king c7. Okay, place b5. Well, here I was thinking like a5 and then king c7, king b6. <laughs> it may sound funny, but I don't know. So my king is blockading and my pieces are playing. And a5, knight c6, I think I'm fine. Let's play it. It's a fun, guys. This king c7 and king b6. <laughs> okay, now knight c5, his bishop is somewhat stuck, I guess. Uh, well, can I play h5? I mean, he probably will play like h3. F h yeah, let's play h5. Looks good. This and I don't know, like rook d7. <laughs> Just since he moves. d8. Is he going for a king walk? Oh, thank you. I was thinking he was going like, king g3, king h4, king g <laughs> And I was like, oh no! <laughs> um, well, don't forget that I can move my knight, if needed, to defense. Well, so he'd like technically just shut down the, the king side. Hold on, rook d8. Is he going to regroup that his rook is blocking? No, it doesn't look so. Okay, it does look so now. <laughs> um, well, then good thing my bishop can move. When he does this, maybe I can play like like rook c7 now or something, so my rook is already ready. Already ready, that's a pretty good word. A rhyme, yes. Rook c7, I don't know. What if I'm coming back? Eh. Uh, well, I can, I can do like rook e7, knight d7, king c5, knight b6. <laughs> I'm not sure. Maybe it's way too cocky, but okay. Well, rook e7. Right now I'm just standing back. Yeah, maybe he wants to break through. Is he going to repeat? Probably not. Maybe yes. I don't know. Three, four, eh. Then it's a shriveled. <laughs> oh no, we're going to play 50 moves. He plays g4. We play another 60, 100 moves. And then he plays another pawn move. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, rook g7. I guess he's maybe planning a g4. No. I hope so. Well, I mean, he has his king ready somewhat, I guess. Please, can you play king of two rook one? That will be a threefold. <laughs> uh huh. He moved his king, so he doesn't want a threefold, does he? <laughs> When was the last time a pawn moved? Was it soon? No, h4. 31. 81. Okay, so I need to hold for like another 20 if something moves. It's three or it's threefold. Can't say it can easy up the day. Is he going to kind for a blockade piece? No, please not. <gasps> no, 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 put 
you night, Rook. Thank you. <laughs> is it like when is Revolt? It's coming any time soon or no? I'm <laughs> not sure. Um, here. Okay, 20 more moves. Unless he plays like G4 or something. Well, but then I can just like ignore him, I guess. <laughs> Uh oh, I, I I really don't like when he has Kin and Rook there. He's like ready for breakthrough. Okay, Rook D7. Play King of Two. I can G2. Da -da -da -da. Okay. He's, it, it seems like he's trying to avoid the shefold as much as he can, to be fair with you. Um, I'm not sure. Yeah, that's your mystery fold. Rook D1. No! That's your mystery fold as well. Rook D1. <laughs> no! That's your mystery fold. <laughs> That! No! That! No! Okay, it seems like it's like six more moves or something. So I'm a little worried he'll play like this, this. But it seems like he's just chilling and repeating. Uh oh! He even burned his other rook here. Uh oh! Uh oh! Thank you so much! Thank you, thank you, thank you for not playing G4. <laughs> thank you. Well, actually, we won 50 more full than D4 this year winning, huh? Uh-huh. But yeah, G4. I mean, I guess I could have just, like, ignored and say play, like, Rook D8. If he plays G5, then another thousand million moves and a draw. So, but that was a pretty good game. But if it would be, like, 49th move, then bam, G4, bam, D3, I'm winning a piece, I'm winning. Um... So that was a pretty good block. <laughs> it was like Great China Wall or something. Uh, now I'm solve puzzles. Classic trainer. Ooh, that's looking interesting. Bam, bam, bam. Ooh, a queen sacrifice. Isn't it be always beautiful? It's like forever green. <laughs> queen sacrifice are always the best. Oh, another queen sacrifice looks like. Maybe not, maybe yes, I don't know, 96. And then another beautiful queen sacrifice. It's a queen sacrifice day. Let's go. No, wait, it's another queen sack? Hmm. It looks so. Bam. Triple queen sack, let's keep it up, nice. It's triple queen sack in a row. Oh no, it doesn't look like a queen sack to me at least now. Uh, 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 is there a queen sack? Please say yes. <laughs> yeah, I was winning at the end. That's a blunder. But I was like my free move roller. <laughs> Wait, I had a blunder? This oh dear. Uh, let's see. Uh, uh, um. I mean, I'm thinking I'm consi I'm like legit considering like queen g4 or something. But I don't think it has a good as it is. What did I say? I don't think it is as good as I'm dreaming it to be, to be fair. Uh, maybe though... Bam, a night sack, as it seems. No! That wasn't Queen of Sea. What was it? We should play 6 and 9 Queen of Sea. Ooh, that's pretty good. Ooh, that looks like I should win a queen. Well, queen before king c6, queen e4, queen e8, queen before king d5, queen d4, king 6 queen e4, queen before king d5, king e4, king e6, queen, queen there, yeah. Okay, that's not a queen side, but I win a queen. Nice! That looks like a queen sack! <laughs> I didn't look doesn't look like a queen sack now. Well, it looks like a knight sack! Let's go! And then rook sack! Bam! So many sacrifices today. It actually is beautiful. Oh wow. Nice. Queen sack, rook sack, blood sack, bishop sack, everything, rook sack, everything, do 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 bam, 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 rook you one, bam, and queen d5, no, it wasn't queen d5, <laughs> it was bishop before, ooh, and a bishop sack, that would have been very nice if I spotted it, but I didn't, let's say queen d2, no, wait, it's queen c1, what, why is it so hard puzzle, eh? it's pretty true, what reason is it? 
2086, how is it made in 2086? What? <laughs> Bishop of seven, knight of seven, rook e4, knight e5. I was thinking about rook e5, a, but then he has rook e5, f, e, f, e, king c5. I think he's winning, but I'm not sure, and I will try it. Yes, yes. Oh, I almost fell asleep. A, rook, and this, and then bam. And I think you can see five. Yes, let's go. So I attack my bishop and my rook. So it's sacrifice day today. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> um. Let's see what's up here. I mean, it looks like it should be some. Oh wait, is it? 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 It is here. Wait for it! No, wait, 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 be careful. Wait for it! Woo, 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 woo! Quinsack! I know you always waited for it! And there it was! So, four Quinsacks out of ten puzzles! That's insane! It looks like another Quinsack! I'm not sure if it is. Oh no, it's not. Or it's not. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Boom, boom. It looks. Yeah. It's way too interesting. Bam! It's like another queen side, guys. Isn't it beautiful? Isn't it magnificent? Now I need to figure out a move, so... Um, the party ends for a bit. Uh, the queen sack in party ends for now. Uh, 96 looks interesting. 96, can h5? 97 there. Well, I can win a queen. Released six six. This skin is like oh, is it dead? I don't know. Oh, well, there is this move. Bam! That looks like I'm very close. Uh, let's see where he's made. Wow, that's a really interesting puzzle. <laughs> Can I just follow you and like peaceful can H2? Is G3 made threat? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe, I don't know. And I can just take win and win, probably. <laughs> but they gotta be made. It has to be made. I mean, Kenichi sure looks like a really nasty move. But I am not exactly sure if I'm going in there. Bam 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 I don't see a move. I don't see a move. I don't see a move. Help me please. Well, I mean, Bishop G5. No, or the kid H2. Oh dear. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. that's not right. <sighs> Rook F5. Rook F4. 97. Ooh, that was a beautiful mate. Ooh, that was so nice, guys. But there was a queen sack again. Mm, well, B4 for sure. Now just has to have to make sure which rook it is. Uh, is it A or is it D? Is it A or is it D or is it A? Is it D? D, 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 D. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Both look with it. I don't know which one means actually. Mm. Looks like both win. I'll take A. Oh, I didn't see that coming. I didn't see Rook C8. Oopsie. But okay, okay, okay. It's fine. Ah, uh, 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 uh. this should be too work. It's really There's actually a rook. Let's go. <laughs> there was a rook db1. The same thing. <laughs> That's actually very cool. That's actually insanely cool that I sack my bishop. Let's go another sack to the list. Uh, mm. Well, I'm sorry, my queen. Where you have to go? Would be better for all of us. Bam! Nice. So 10 solves, 3 fail. Let's go. That's really, really good. 
Okay, now let's quickly analyze this game. So, land turn 26, actually for him, 19, 42 for me, 0 brain moves for each of us, 1 brain move for him, 0 for me, 28 excellent moves for him, 28 best moves for him, 30 for me, 20 excellent moves for him, 19 for me, 19 good moves for him, 16 for me, 6 moves for him, 5 for me, 9 next for him, made for me, uh, 1 blunder for, 1 mistake for each of us, I'm sure that's like this, so, 2, uh, 2 blunders for him, 1 for me, and 3 mistakes for each of us, but the blunder, the one blunder he made was like, that blunder at absolutely at all. So, this is the last book move, knight c6. I was slightly worse if it was a mistake. To increase bishop's scope by moving it to a better square. Was it g7 or was it c5? Both look pretty cool actually. Probably c5 though. Oh, it sinks so slowly. Well, is it bishop c5? No, it's bishop e7. Okay. Yeah, I was thinking of coming back. Alright. Now let's see. Mm, ah, so just one more left. Uh, you had only one good option in here. You missed an opportunity to increase. Ah, oh, bishop c6, bishop a4. That's pretty good, actually. Okay, b5 was a blunder. Then my king, the hero of the blockade piece. Then he closed everything. And then it was basically a waiting game. I was. Rook here, rook there, 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 rook here, 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 here. I was just waiting. I didn't want to do anything. He didn't want to do anything. Here, here, here. That was an doesn't hurt. How it hurt? What? How? What? Here? No. What? Did I have to play? The rook c8. Oh no! This will be long. Like rook here. No. Oh. Uh, bishop a8. Oh no, I need a hint. Sorry guys, but like it will... Oh, it's... There's no hint! Ah, there. Bishop... Bishop c8 is the best? How... How... How come? And then I was doing all the same stuff, it was fine. Just coming weird. Yeah, okay. So plus two. I was sure... I wasn't sure if g4... Well, okay. Yeah, it's a lot... Yeah. Then I take, take, and then rook d8. And if he tries to go like this, I go here, and if he plays this, okay, I'm better. Alright, that was a really clean game. And there was a really clean stream as well, I'm pretty sure that this is not into a such sneaky move, actually. But whatever. <laughs> if we don't this when we're fairly willing. But okay, so, I'll end the stream. Hope you enjoyed it. If you didn't, please don't clap, scope, team, and clap, and have my clap. There. I will answer three members and kill very around 37 more members. And I will make tournament 200 members. So feel free to join. I will be very, very happy. And also, please join the chess. Best coach and club and teams there are. Let's see, let's see, let's see. There are 1080 members. Thank you very, very much. It's really, it's a lot to me. So just 20 members and I'll make tournament 1100 members. So for three join, you will be happy. And thank you for following on the chess, on YouTube, and on Twitch. And as usual, click the like button and subscribe to me. Please don't see you on chess, club, And also, don't forget to join my Discord where you get notifications when I start streaming. Link in the description. And yeah, bye bye, 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 bye b